Yo, what's up? Name is Jet Leo one and welcome back to some more Paper Mario. In the last episode, we took on a bunch of bonus bosses. Can't see Koopa and the Master twice. This time, it's time to go to Kamui. I just gotta remember how. Let's see, I believe it has something to do with over here. I also need to check something anyways. Let me see, this is the one that leads to the ghost house, right? Never mind, it leads to the Yoshis, but that's even better. Because I need to buy some life shrew. And this is not the one that has it. I think it is the ghost mansion that has life shrooms. I don't know. But it was nice to see you, Yoshis, again. That's wrong. Oh well. Switch back to... Uh, I'm going to need Lucky Lester for this one. Thank you for your help with the master, Watt, but... Oh, I should have switched to Lucky Lester. Never mind. Oh, come on. I don't feel like dealing with you. Leave me alone. You're not even worth my time. Let's see how much, how many star points we get from these losers. Nothing. Look at that. We don't get Jack because these guys suck and we still have to fight them though because they hit us. One star point. Pity star point. You guys aren't worth it. No! <laughs> to quote Hubert in the enemy, or quote, quote Hubert's uh, end of battle victory quote from Tales of Grace's F. Sometimes I don't see the value in fighting. There's no profit in the enemies here. It's a waste of time. I just love that him and Asbel both have hilarious win quotes where, like, they say something stu- They say something meaningful and then say something stupid. Sometimes I regret the past. Why didn't I push harder for a raise in my allowance? Oh, Asbel. That game is awesome. I'm glad I went and beat it. Now let's do some jumps. I failed. This is why I could never do a speed run when it's like, oh, this is a simple trick. I just immediately massively fail. And here we go. Let's see, I believe there's something this way. Just for walking, you get a free upgrade. It's nice. Who do, am I think? Let's get Bo, because she has the most attack. 10 damage. It's a really useful skill. So now everybody who needs to be upgraded is upgraded. The rest of them would just be for 100%. And I believe that this also is... Or no. Never mind. We already went and found the... Uh, Chet Rippo. Or Rip Cheeto. We already found Rip Cheeto. Okay. I thought there was an item back there. My bad. Anyways, enough messing around. Time for Chapter 7. Star Spirit on Ice. I love this chapter. It's so cool! <laughs> no, but really it is. I just like ice places. I hate ice physics, but I like ice places. Yeah, hello. This is the northernmost burg, Shiva City. You come from Toad Town? Very, very far away, ah. Huh? Welcome to Shiva City. Oh, I forgot to call it Kamui City, but that sounds weird. I can't remember what the name of the village in Kamui is anyway. So it's going to be Shiva City in the Kamui region. I'm the city guard around here. I'm investigating a report of a suspicious character wandering around the city. You. You're not him, are you? Not in this game. I'm only that guy in Mario Sunshine, and... No doubt this is probably going to wind up cracking eventually. What are you doing? Stop that! Have you lost your wits? What if the ice breaks? No, are you a complete idiot? I told you not to do that. That's really dangerous. No. He hauls you off. I didn't know he did that. Don't you ever listen? You're a public nuisance. Take a hike. <laughs> he freaking kicks you. I didn't know that. I have never seen that. So there's a key down there, and I need that key. Hey, don't body block me, man. We're on alert because a stranger appeared in the city, so I can't let you pass without permission from the mayor. Well, then we better go get permission from the mayor. Who's this? An empty house. A likely story. 
Now I know everything that goes on here because this part is so hilarious you can't forget it. And you'll see what I mean by hilarious in a little bit. Let's see, does this have life shrooms? Life shroom! Yes. 40 coins, many thanks. How many items do I have? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Full 10. Alright. Time to see what's up in this cool town. They have pretty nice houses here. It's really well designed. Stormborn Valley and Kamui Mountain are both near here. Or what? I can't remember what the... Uh, Ezo Fuji, I think it was. So Starborn Valley and Shiver... Or Starborn Valley and Ezo Fuji are both near here. But you better dress warmly if you plan on reaching them. Nah, don't worry. Mario's overalls have heaters in them. That's why he's allowed to go... Heaters and air conditioners. That's why he can go through the desert and then go to the ice area, no problem. Anyone for a shaved ice treat? Strawberry flavored? Maybe watermelon? All my personal favorite, Tangy Tangerine. Ho ho, I love frozen treats. I wouldn't mind some too. Huh? Awesome. I missed. Chuck Quizmo, we're gonna talk to you later. But first, I want this. Only the second window lets you open it. Let's see. Paracarry, we need you now. After a long time, I'm not really needing you. You had like one duty, and that was to get us over the gaps of spikes. And now we don't need you, because Lackey Lester can do the same thing. Treasure chest? It's a house with no door. Attack effects? E-badge. What does that one sound like? Badges. All badges. A off. E on. Yoshi! That's awesome. I'm going to keep that one for a while. I don't think I've ever gotten that. You learn something new every day. Or to quote, summer games done quick and awesome games done quick. I've never seen that happen before. <laughs> so funny, like all the runs that I've been watching of summer games done quick, every last one of them is like, I've never seen that before at least once. Oh, we have a guest. Welcome, you poor man. You must be freezing. If you'd like to see my husband, he's in the other room. Please go right in. Let's go talk to him. Sir, are you okay? Let's see. Present, shelf, guy who's knocked out. Dude, did you drop a present on your head? That's silly. No reply. Mayor Penguin's body doesn't budge an inch. What's this? He has a memo in his hand that says Herringway. Memo? Looks like a present tag to me. Darling, would you like a cup of tea? Hmm? Oh, dear, you know you'll catch a cold if you sleep there. Does he do this all the time? Is he narcoleptic? No! Okay, what's with the panicky camera angle that suddenly gave me a headache? Help! Somebody! Anybody! My husband is dead! He's been murdered! Now wait a minute. It's a penguin murder mystery! I doubt that. I'm pretty sure he just dropped something on his head. Because he's an idiot. What's going on here, madam? Just calm down now. You need to speak slowly so I can get to the bottom of this. You again! Don't make me punt you through this house. I will punt you through this house in vengeance. My husband is dead. Look at him lying there. Oh, my darling husband. Somebody clipped his flippers. Best euphemism ever. They clipped his flippers. No, he's not dead. They just clipped his flippers. By Puffin, you're right. The mayor's been murdered. This is like a mystery novel, except it's real. How tragic. But, madam, if I may ask, who on earth would have had a reason to put this penguin on ice? Oh, the puns. The puns. Him, right there, that man with the suspicious mustache. What are you talking about? You invited me in here. You were being nice earlier. Don't flip on me. I told him not to come in the house, but he barged right in. Don't you dare lie, lady. My husband was alive right up until this man showed up. You weren't in here. You don't know that. He was dead when I got here, too. Or dead. I still say he just knocked out. People don't die in the Mario universe unless they put, turn into a bunch of puffs of smoke. He's not a puff of smoke. He's a body. He's got to be alive. Hey, you mustache! Are you listening? This good woman's accusing you. What do you say for yourself? I didn't do it. Mario Sunshine Tent senses tingling. No one's believing me, even though the princess is on my side. <laughs> I just love that Mario Sunshine. It's like, the, pr the queen of your country is like, objection! You're like, overruled! Don't even listen to what she said. She's overruled! You can't do that. Phoenix Wright would have your head for that. <laughs> 
Don't try to play ignorant with me, buddy. I'm a professional. We got a witness here. You're not a professional. Otherwise, you'd have already solved it. And you don't have the right hat. And you don't have a guy named Watson backing you up. And you don't have a magnifying glass. And you don't live in London. You don't work with Scotland Yard. And you're not cool enough. Isn't that right, madam? Yes, that's right. He did it in cold blood. I uh, saw it with my own eyes. Through a shut door with no glass. Lady, you're a terrible liar. Besides, he's the only one who came into this room. It all adds up. That present over there says it fell on him. Gravity is the culprit here. So you're sticking to your story, claiming you're not the culprit? I read that in the wife's voice. What? Are you nuts, man? Mario's not a murderer. That's completely ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I tell you now. Huh, if you're telling the truth, then we're dealing with a backroom murder case. Oh, I never trained for this. Did you train for anything? A backroom murder case. A high-ranking penguin slain. How could such a horrible plot twist hit our peaceful city? You, Mr. Mustache, once more for the record, you swear you didn't do this? Yeah, I swear I didn't do this. Okay, I think I believe you, but this means we have to find the true murderer. Ah, perfect. I'll give you a chance. Since you claim that you're not the guilty party, then you must bring me the murderer yourself. If you do that, I'll believe you. It's the only way. Alright, off with you. You haven't proved that you're innocent yet, so I must forbid you to leave the city. Well, we couldn't leave anyway. Lady, you're mean. You killed him, didn't you? I knew my instincts were right. When I saw a stranger like you out here in such a remote place, I knew that you must be up to no good. Oh, the horror. My poor, poor penguinkins. Please forgive me for letting this murderer in the house. I'm going to steal your ice cream. Okay, the Yoshi's not as cool as I thought it was. Let me see here. Badge. All badge. Down to the bottom. Go away. Come back. Ah, it's good to have it back. Now then, Quizmo, I'm a murderer. Let's go take a quiz. What's it gonna be this time? Goombario Tattle. Yay. Congratulations, have a star piece. You got a star piece. Well, well, so long, farewell, till we meet again. And yeah, every time you answer a question, it goes up by a question, not by where he is. So just because I'm up here in Kamui doesn't mean he's going to ask questions about, like, Chapter 6. Alright. So there was a key in the lake and a locked building. Let's go combine the two. Activate. Sushi's useful again. Alright, so there's a lock back there. We're going to get this key and then use it. But aren't you cold, Mario? It's kind of freezing water. That was just ice. It just had ice over it. No spin dash. I'm trapped. Warehouse key. I know how this section goes. This section's pretty confusing if you don't know what to do. But I luckily do know what to do. Anything back here? No. Awesome. Epic jump! Fall down the chimney. What in the... Why are you in my fireplace? You found my secret room. Through the chimney. Ingenious. Hello, who are you? Me? I'm Herringway, the novelist. Haven't you heard of me? I don't read books. I play video games. What? Mayor Penguin was murdered, and I'm the chief suspect? You must be joking! That's ridiculous, I did no such thing. Well, neither did I, and they blamed me first. You're very suspicious, huh? Well, I suppose I would be too. It appears as though I should drop in at the mayor's house. Yeah, you do that. Engage stairs! That's awesome. Alright then, come on, let's go to the mayor's house. So where there was a secret floor. That's how he did it. Ingenious. Just race back over. And if you talk to all the people, they keep... Well, this guy's nice. But everyone, like... I don't know. <laughs> okay, that guy was, was funny. He was like, What? Herringway can't be the murderer? But then again, ever since I've read his books, I've come to expect the unexpected. These guys just talk trash about you. Go away. They all sit there and call you the murderer. Herringway, let's go. Let's get to the bottom of this case right now.
Oh, you again. Have you come up with anything? Huh? Say, isn't that penguin behind you the mystery novel writer named Herringway? What, what? Mayor Penguin was clutching a piece of paper that had Herringway written on it. Bah, if that were true, I most certainly would have noticed it. Do you have any training whatsoever in anything, including basic life skills like common sense? Huh, he definitely does appear to be holding a piece of paper. Yes, of course, it's a message about his death. With this last breath, the mayor told us the murderer's identity. Now why are you nodding, Mario? It's not a good clue. Just a piece of paper. It could mean anything. He could have been meaning to send a letter to him. So, Mr. Hangway, you cold-hearted murderer. It all makes sense now. No wonder your novels are so exciting and suspenseful. You live out your own plots. Dear man, do you have any idea how ridiculous you sound? You actually think I would do this to the mayor? He's a great friend of mine. Huh, yes. Yes, you are good friends. Aha, but that was just a cover so no one suspect you of this heinous crime. That's it, isn't it? I've solved this crafty mystery. You didn't solve anything. You're too dumb for that. All you're good at is punting people away from frozen lakes because they danced on it. Oh, come on, really? You simple, simple penguin. I would never be so predictable. Besides, I'm completely innocent. I've been working in my house on my new novel for weeks. I didn't have time to sneak over here and kill Mayor Penguin. I'd just like to say that I still think the man with the mustache is the murderer. Lady, shut up. Back out. Nobody wants you here. Huh, this penguin murder mystery is getting more intriguing all the time. Hey, uh, the corpse is twitching, which means it's not a corpse. Or he's a zombie. You never know. Ah. Uh. Oh, my aching. Ouch. Eek! My husband's returned. He's a ghost. Eek! Oh, good gracious. Hello, everyone. What's going on here? Well, what, Mayor? We thought you were dead. Our backroom murder history is awash. What a plot twist. Huh? What are you talking about? Um, I think I seem to remember going for the shelf to get the souvenir for Herringway. Oh yes, of course. I reached up, slipped, and then whacked my head on the floor. Yes, that's what happened. Just like I called it. There's an object on the floor, a shelf, and a guy who's knocked out. It kind of means he dropped it on himself. Best lifting animation ever. Does the arm lift and it teleports into his hand. Here you are, Herringway. This is what I was searching for. Toad Town was great fun. So many interesting sights. Wish you could have been there. Sometime after all this hubbub settles down, I'll give you a full account of the big city. Have a present. Well, uh, thank you, old friend. That's very thoughtful. But, Mayor, here we were thinking that you'd been murdered. The whole city was up in arms. Next time, be more careful. Next time, don't be so dumb. Notice they didn't even call a medic. It's like, we have somebody who's hurt. Let's not call the doctors. Ah, oh, yes, so sorry. Haha, <laughs> I thought it rather entertaining, actually. Besides, everything's okay now. The maze is just fine. I must return to my home now. I believe I've just had an idea for the sequel to my new novel. He's pulling a castle. Right and on life. Um, I have the best intentions, but for some reason I always end up causing a ruckus. Hello. Sorry about all that. I must apologize. Say, you're Mario, aren't you? Well, let me welcome you to, to Shiver City, Jewel of the North. What's the matter? Oh, you want to hike over to Starborn Valley, do you? I see, of course. I'll tell the gatekeeper to allow you out of the city. You'd better bundle up. They keep telling me to bundle up, but I can't be cold. Uh, I knew you were innocent the whole time. A backroom murder case? Please, how completely silly. That overzealous guard must have read too many mystery novels. <laughs> Lady, I hate you forever. Don't ever talk to me ever again. Don't ever talk to me again. Well, that's it for the backroom murder mystery. I told you this was interesting. Let's see. How's my health doing? Okay. I'm good to go start hiking. Or at least I would be. But I do believe I should end the episode right about now. Because the road is full of stuff up ahead. Is there anything here? It's just an empty path. Oh, never mind. There is something to do. Hey, 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 hey! Hiya! <laughs> I've been waiting for you, Mario! I've been here forever! I was getting desperate! I thought I was gonna freeze! This place is freezing and cold and nasty and icy! I hate it! I can't take it anymore! I gotta get out of here! I'm gonna beat you up in record time and head back to someplace warm! You ready, Ice Boy? Let's do it! Leroy! 
Oh, I've been busy, Mario. I've learned cool techniques. Check this out. Aha! Uh -huh. What you got now? Look at that piece of work. I've been taking a little magic course on the side. From the community college. Because it's cheaper. What? Don't complain. And now you're going to be on a final exam. Yeah, I've got to win this time. 50 HP. Oh, you poor little fool. <laughs> Seven damage. Eh. I need Watt out for this one. Armor piercing is important. Mario, you like magic tricks? You won't like this one. It's really hard to block that, and that hits hard. Ha 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 ha, that felt fantastic. I just keep on getting better. Turbo charge. Ah, oh, I missed them. That's messed up. Oh well. He won't last long enough for it to really matter anyways. 35. Ow. That hurts. Two, one, one, one. Aw, oh, I keep missing him. I keep getting seven and then I screw up. Electro dash. Get wrecked, kid. Your armor is worth nothing to me. There we go. Finally managed to block it. Attack power is returned to normal, but I keep getting seven exactly. Okay. Doing good. Super Bounce is amazing. It just sucks because he has armor. So it's doing less than it could right now. But luckily, there's a toad house right behind us that we can just go to and refresh. Everything that you lose. Because normally there'd be enemies on this road. But because he's here, they don't put him, the enemies there to make it fair to you. 24 star points. Nice. No! And for being dumb, you deserve that. But anyways, this has been Jet and One. I will see you next time as we continue onward here in Kamui and go to Starborn Valley. See you then.